one's still there, Mama, now! There! You know, these geological maps aren't as far off as we thought. But we're still gonna break it through right here, and then run it off over there. This is not the best place to build a road. Yeah, but it's the straightest. And when Agma starts building those wells down in La Mistas, this will be the only way to get the equipment there. These religious markers are salmon. They're supposed to be protected by the government. Not anymore, they aren't. Agmas has an agreement with Angama. Now back it up, two more. Oh, oh. I told you I'd get you to Agmas. There you are. Proof positive. Proof of anything right now, just a couple of guys working. You seem to have an axe to grind against Agmas. What's that about? Uh, it's a little personal thing that goes back a ways. It has to do with a plane and a lot of pain. I owe him one. So what's your beef? I mean, you hired me. You got something against Agnes? No, no, I'm just, I'm just looking for a story. Uh, listen, reports were that that construction crew isn't meeting its workload, making the company lose a lot of money. Philip Coulter isn't known for wasting money. Therefore, there's something going on. Yeah, the mysterious Philip Coulter, owner and president of Agnes. That's the guy I need to be talking to. How many photos you need of guys working anyway? You in a hurry? No, no, not me. No. I got all the time in the world. At least till your 1500s up. Oh, yeah. All right, let's pack it up. Get the heavy equipment out here. Let's get out of here. That was bracketing fire, textbook military style. They say true to form. Everybody got their range and they're waiting. Waiting for what? For whoever's left behind. That, my friend, would be us. And we're stuck here? For how long? Quite possibly the rest of our lives. Okay, that Jeep. We got one shot. We hit it, we hit it moving. So you got keys? Well, we I mean, the keys are in it. Yeah, I mean, why would they take the keys out? This is a good neighborhood. Another 1,500. All right. Lower your center of gravity and crawl over the hood. Got it. Easy. Grab my hand. Easy. Easy. Okay, Cutter. You. All right. Easy does it. All right. You guys ready? What? Oh, God. This!
These are just some minor burns and scrapes. Do you know that it was the Soman? It had to be. This is their territory. Those stone markers were their Khalifa. Khalifa? Burial ground. Sacred. But why would they attack at all, even with the burial grounds being disturbed? The Soman disavowed violence years ago. It makes no sense. Well, whoever it was, they were good. What they did was military textbook. You. You're a reporter. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Kinda. I mean, I, I do a lot of freelance work. <laughs> I read this book, All the President's Men. The power of the press is very strong. I'd like to use that. Oh, excuse me? Suddenly you're Woodward and Bernstein? Shina is correct. Agnes has no business in the La Mistas, especially destroying native land. If you can get the word out, maybe they will stop. The Soman couldn't possibly go up against Agnes. They'd be destroyed. That's why we need to get Agnes out. That's where you come in. Public pressure, huh? You know, it's worked before. Agnes had to shut down in the Philippines because of world opinion. Good. Now we leave. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, Missy. We are not going anywhere. This is my client, and he's already paid for my services. Half paid, I might remind him. Oh, he's still your client. Because you're going along. What? You know something about the way these men were attacked. And that's very important. So come on. I absolutely refuse. I'll double your fee. Morning, Stanton. You're looking radiant as usual. I appreciate the compliment, but I don't have time for pleasantries. Mr. Coulter sent me to speak with you directly. Ah, and how is my favorite multi-billionaire? A bit concerned. The Suman Petroleum Project is running into problems. The cost overruns are beginning to mount. Ah, oh, security concerns. I believe we've already gone through this. No, no. What we discussed was a possible terrorist attack by Defari forces. We have since learned that Defari has no terrorist cells in that part of the country. With this knowledge, Mr. Coulter would ask where his money is going to. But do you have proof of this? I don't, but Mr. Coulter does. Then perhaps Mr. Coulter would like to come and see me personally. Very well. This afternoon, sooner if you wish. Mr. Coulter's in the country. Mr. Coulter is wherever he needs to be. Mm, two hours, perhaps. Recent security reports agree with your conclusion. Ah. Defari was not involved. Hmm. It's a regional problem, which we are taking care of. How? I am assembling a research team that will enter the Lemistas. Agnes can only hope that this research team has the necessary equipment with which to deal with the problem permanently. I'll be in touch. I have Mumbato here in one hour. much. I can understand that. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. She's also a very even-tempered person. Unless you take her photo. You like that camera? You're a little protective of her, aren't you? Nope. Of me. You're my client. You take her photo, I get thrown off the cliff. Got anything interesting? A map for the Soman Petroleum Project. Whatever that is. Yeah, I know exactly what that is. A few years back, Ngamo was tooting his horn about a major oil refinery off the coast. Had to be shut down because of environmental reasons. Well, he's, he's moving it inland. Right here on the map. This is where the construction crew was attacked. But that doesn't make sense. If the project was halted... No, actually, it, it does make sense. Ngamo's had to lay low for a while. I bet he's gambling. He can get this thing up and running. 
before anyone can do anything about it. You can stop it. You can make sure the, the world knows about it, right? Yeah, technically, but uh, need more proof. And I need to know who attacked them. Well, that's a human interest story right there. Well, someone attacked him, I'm sure of it. Yeah. And they need our help. Come on. All right. <clears throat> One warning. That's all you get. You weren't kidding, were you? I told you. She's shy. What's her story? Is she taken? Or available? Well, um, neither. <laughs> I didn't know there was a third option. Yeah, well, there's a lot you don't know. <laughs> Looks like the attack has them spooked. Yeah. They sure aren't getting much done, are they? Good. Stay here. I'm gonna look around. Tarakna? No. Not yet. Tarakna. Are you two speaking code? No, it's. Yeah. Yeah, it's a thing we do. You know, it's like, uh. Hello, talk. Yeah. Oh, tell me how. I mean, more than half our people are on guard duty. Where is the security promised by Ingama? Security? What security? Oh, we get some soldiers up here every now and then. The blackmail's for more equipment, but we ain't got no security. Mr. Coulter wants you back on schedule starting today. What? Today. Damn. We got one hour to get everything back in the jungle. One hour. Move it. Go. No. no. I'm not going. Okay, I've got more than enough here. Oh, 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 oh. She has said to stay put. All right, when she says that, you learn pretty quickly. She's got reasons. I'm just going to the other side of that clearing. Strange. What, this part or the part back there? Or well, the Jeep going off the cliff part, because that's got to count in the strange department, too. Well, if it was a Selman's tribe, it's just not like them to wage war, especially take hostages. Well, strange times demand strange solutions. Well, these Selmans seem to know what they're doing, but they're only going up against the construction crew, right? Don't move. Viet Cong. Cong and Sandinista. It's guerrilla tactics. Guerrillas wouldn't do something like this. No, it's, uh, it's a type of warfare. 
Your people are very strange. Well, Miss Pot, meet Mr. Kettle. Okay. Let's call in the troops. Whose troops? And Gamas? He's the one that brought Agmas in. Besides, you said that the Somans couldn't take on the military. Sheena, you, me, two of us, there. Tribe, lots of warriors. Take your time. Think about it. You're right. We're outnumbered. Thank you. It's only one answer. Here. Come here. What? A booby trap? Yep. Okay. Now that we have a moment, would you like to tell me how getting caught serves us? We had to get to Peter. Here we are. <laughs> ah, so we've got them right where we want them. Exactly. Yeah. All I know is these savages have us prisoner. Savages? These savages are the people we're trying to protect. You are Kali's child, aren't you? Yes. You know her. Kali is legend among many. I have not had the honor of meeting her. However, we have heard of her and her child. Shaina, is it? Yes. That is my Kaya name. But you can call me Sheena. Ah. Is Sheena an enemy of the Soman? Definitely not. I came to help. This man, he can tell the world about this. He can make the construction crew go away. But you have to let him go. Let us go. <sighs> this is not for me to decide. It is for the Bankui. Bring them. Bankui, now what's that? It's their leader, the head warrior. The peaceful Soman have become a tribe of warriors. That is not the Soman way. The Bangui have taught us how to defeat our enemies. The Bangui knows the outsiders and their ways. We have won many victories. Well, this is a war you can't win. Agmas has the support of Ngama. He's got an entire army. He will also suffer defeat at the hands of the Bankui. The Soman do not want war, but we have been given no choice. But don't you understand I can help? Just let me go. Us? You ask us to trust you? You must understand. Trust is in short supply. Even for the daughter of Kali. Three of you are to stay here until this issue is decided. The Bankui says that Ngama will be told of the hostages and that they will be executed unless he leaves our land. If the Bankui is so brave to condemn men to death, then why doesn't he show his face? Impossible. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey. Whoa, 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 man. What kind of man are you? A smart one. Just shut up and watch. Sheena, daughter of Kali. If you reach this line, the Bankui will agree to your request. You are to make sure she does not. Jumbo. Something. We can't. <laughs> 
Understand your mission? Yes, to find and destroy all incidents. Let us choose to say we are to pacify any discontent within the region. Yes, sir. The area we are going to pacify is no place for a lady. With all due respect, Mr. President, screw that. There's the possibility of a hostage situation. Well, we know nothing of that. And even if it were true, it is no reason for you to get involved personally. It's every reason. Now, are we moving out, or do I have to have Agnes pull out of every development program in your country? Agnes can do as it pleases. Maltaka was here long before your Mr. Calter left grade school. And Maltaka will be here long after he has fallen. Still, it is, as they say, your life. I give you my permission. Thank you. It's the Wellman kid. Now I get it. A year ago, this, this kid, a, a cadet at some military academy in Texas, went crazy, ran a tank into the administration office and took off. They caught up with him on a cruise ship, of all places. Guy jumps overboard and everyone thinks he's dead. How can you be sure it's the same guy? Well, a name tag on his shirt was a giveaway, for one thing. That explains the military tactics. Well, I'm worried about Sheena. She was pretty banged up. I'll tell them what they're doing to her right now. No. Wait! Oh. I'd like to keep the arm attached to the shoulder, if you don't mind. How is your arm? Imani struck you several times there. <sighs> Kamani struck me several times all over. The Bankui have a high regard for warriors. You beat Kimani. He was impressed. The Bankui is just a child. You must see that. The Bankui came to us almost a full season ago, just before the men with the machines arrived. The Bankui taught us, showed us that we need not be afraid, that this was our land to be defended. But the Soman used to believe in peace. Yes. And there are days that I miss that. But this is for our future. We will fight them on the land, on the sea, and in the air. The Bankui taught us that. I am not sure how we fight them in the air. It depends on the type of war they bring us. If they come to us by air, we will find a way to fight them there. You can't win. We are winning. Those people think the Somin are simple, peace-loving folk. And when I got here, they were. But I changed all that. You gave them war. I gave them hope. I taught them that they only find peace when they have strength. They had no one to lead them, but now they do. From what I've been told, you're American. You were orphaned. You had no choice in being here, is that true? Yes. This is my home, now and forever. As it is mine. 
by my choice. I am also an orphan, a product of the state, as they say. No one knew what to do with me, so they put me into military school, and I didn't know what to do with that. So I left. I came here. And I found a home. Oh, hello there. Nice of you to stop by. I've reached a decision. We'll keep only one hostage. But you can decide which one it is. And I can decide which one you'll execute? Not likely. We came here to help you. That is my decision. Now choose. Wait. If I can get the construction crew to leave your homeland completely, will you trust me then? One will stay. If you can get the crew to leave by sunrise tomorrow, I'll let the other one go. Now choose. Oh, that kid is out of his mind. No, he's absolutely right. He's just going about it all wrong. Part of me understands exactly what they're going through. If Kali and Ukiah were threatened like this. Oh, heaven help the offenders. I'd react the same way. Oh. But I think he's, he's just never had anything to believe in, or anyone to believe in him. This is his way of feeling wanted. Later on, remind me to tell you how truly remarkable you are sometimes. So how long do you think it will take for Angama to intervene? Not long. What do we do? Do we wait till a little dark and break Peter out? Well, if I free him, the someone will never trust me. And that's a bad thing? Okay, okay, you're right. You're steaming toward a brick wall and don't even know it. So what are we gonna do? Okay, what am I gonna do? Run! Everybody, it's coming! And it's huge! work. You back to normal yet? Yeah, oh, you yeah. should be. Oops. Maybe not. I lived up to my word. Now you must live up to yours. Let him go. How can I be sure you made the crew leave? I told you that I would do it, and I've done it. Respectfully, Bangui. She did give her word, and carried it through. You promised to write this story, to get it into the press? Front page, every major city, believe me. Tell them the Soman fought and won, but you can't mention me. Whatever you want, man, just let me out of here. Leaders. 
should have stayed a tribe of peace. We have control of the target. We are conducting a search for the ones who've escaped. It looks as if they're about to move the villagers out of here, which is smart because this area is tough to defend. David, you know that area better than anyone. David, we need you. What? We need you. OK, these guys are heavily armed. Their weakest moment will come when they move out, so that's got to be our moment of attack. No. The terrain is too complex. We'd have to be here and here. We'd be at a disadvantage. I did a paper on the strategic movements and designs of Erwin Rommel. Great, so you know how to read. Right? What you're lacking is a little field experience. Something I've got too much of. All right, we use the terrain to our advantage. Look, uh, <clears throat> this is getting a little busy, you know? There's no way a handful of us is gonna go against well-trained soldiers. The horns of the bull. I read about the Great Zulu War with the British. Yes. I send the Lana. It might work. I'm lost. Is anybody else lost? I, I know I am. The Zulus had a tactic called the Horns of the Bull. The main force of attack was head on, but the other forces would surround the enemy from the sides, like the horns of a bull. Classic pincher movement. Exactly. I read about many like that. But I've never seen anything like this in the field. Think it'll work? Only one way to find out. What happened to the hostage you had? We let him go. Where is he? I do not know this. We gave him his freedom. Why do you care? Look, you've gotten this all wrong. What we're trying to do is for everyone. We're trying to build an energy plant. Don't, don't you see how that can help people? I see how this can help you. But no one asked us if you could come here. No. No one did. Now, one more time. Where is the hostage? Spread your men out in front of the trucks and to the sides. Let the ones in front attack first. And then bring in the horns. Oh, oh, where are you going? I have to change. What does that mean? It's an attitude thing. safer there. Thank you. What's your name? Cutter. Matt Cutter. Matt Cutter. Mm. I'll remember that. Oh, 
What the hell was was that creature? That was the Durakna, the protector of the Lamistas, and now the protector of the Soman. Durakna, again. <laughs> So when I get back to civilization, I'll make a phone call to Philip Coulter. After I threaten to print everything I've seen, I'm sure he'll back off. Thank you for doing this. Are you kidding? Thank you. I owe you my life. I hope we can meet again sometime. Well, anything is possible. <clears throat> uh, I'll wire you your money, Cutter. Thanks again. Sophie writes about the Soman and not the Darachna. Even if he does, it doesn't matter. It's just another part of the legend. I wanted to thank you again. I thought I knew everything. I thought I knew how to lead people, but... But a leader isn't just here. It's here. They don't teach that at the academy. So what will you do? Go back? I don't know. I'd like to stay, but not as Ben Kui, but as a member of the tribe. That is, if the tribe will still have me. You are, and always will be, Soman. <sighs> I feel kind of strange. I don't know, kind of like... Like you've accomplished something good? Like you've made a difference? No. More like I'll never see the money Peter owes me. Something tells me that we'll see him again. I can feel it. Now listen to me. I want the men and the equipment out of there by tomorrow afternoon. Don't worry about Ngama. The last thing he wants to see in his office is me. European partners are upset. As well they should be, sir. But they'll get over it. Listen, you tell Ngama that I'm canceling this project. But I'm not pulling out of his market. Tell him I was impressed by his efforts. But make sure he understands that I was not. Oh, oh get the film in this camera. Yes, Mr. Coulter. Would you like me to find out? Yes. Find out everything you can about her. 